Do you ever wonder what it is that helps you keep your balance? Hi, I'm Tatiana Sanders, a junior here at the University of North Florida in Jacksonville. We have some physical therapy graduate students helping researchers correct balance issues in young kids. Kinetics media with effusion is really a larger medical term for an inner ear infection with fluid that is kept inside the ear. Currently I have a study that is partially funded by the Brooks Foundation and um, we are looking at the effects of this otitis media with effusion on development in young children. Um, this is a, a condition that really affects children very young. One to three years of age is the most common age. And what we've identified thus far is that when you have the fluid in the ear, it affects the inner ear's functioning, which in turn um, is affecting the development of gaze stabilization, kids' ability to see and visually focus on items, their balance and gross motor development. Beginning approximately one and a half years ago, the students in the physical therapy program are given the opportunity to participate in faculty research. And four students um, actually decided that they wanted to work on this project and have worked for the last year and a half. They learned all the testing procedures with posturography, the large machine behind me, gross motor development testing, and really uh, were able to do all the testing on all of the children that we've seen to date. So they really got exposed to the testing procedures, which are procedures that they would use as a pediatric physical therapist. Dr. Ryan originally presented this study to the entire class, and um, it was focusing on pediatrics, and I thought that would be very interesting. I hadn't had very many, uh, very much experience with pediatrics um, in physical therapy, and I felt that it would be beneficial for me. I am working with um, the posturography machine to check balance for, with children with middle ear effusion. And we're seeing some results that show that when children do have middle ear, middle ear effusion, that they do have balance deficits. Dr. Ryan is an excellent professor, and I thought she would make a great mentor. So that was the first reason that I wanted to work under her. And second, I wanted to experience working with children, which um, I thought I might want to do in the future. Well, up to this time, they've primarily done a lot of classroom work. They've learned the hows and whys and whats and wherefores. Um, and they've done some clinical experiences. But what this has provided them is the opportunity to work with children, to actually do the testing on children that actually have the problem working with parents, and to appreciate what it's like to schedule and, and work with these children before they're feeling very well and then after they're feeling very well. So that's really prepared them to work in the field of pediatric physical therapy. I hope that I can continue with research and in any area, whether it's with vestibular research or orthopedics or sports, I think just having the experience of the process of a research study will, will help me be able to, to use that in the future. If you have any questions or are interested in any of our graduate programs, visit unf.edu.